do you know you can get more by bridging so from Solana DevNet to Mona Testnet? A few months ago, I showed you how to get more by bridging Sepulia X, but in this video, I'll be showing you how to get more by bridging DevNet so to Mona Testnet. The first thing you need is so on Solana DevNet. You can do that by claiming DevNet Soul on the various faucets available. Check out the link in the description for a list of faucets you can claim Dev Soul from. With this faucet, you can claim up to five DevNet Soul every 24 hours. So if you're using Phantom Wallet, you can switch to Solana DevNet by clicking the profile icon at the top left, clicking settings scrolling to developer settings click developer settings and enable testnet mode so you can see that solana devnet is one of the options so select solana devnet and here you can see your solana devnet balance here so to copy your address click receive and click the copy icon next to devnet if you're using software click the settings icon at the bottom right click general click network and make sure you select devnet so here you can also see your devnet balance and you can copy your solana address by clicking the copy icon here or by clicking receive and clicking copy address so with this address you can claim devnet so from the faucet i shared earlier once you've gotten enough devnet so the next thing to do is to visit monadbridge.com you'll find the link in the description so once you land on the bridge click select token click so and here you see the option to connect source wallet so click connect source wallet and select your preferred solana wallet for this example i'll be using soulflare the next thing to do is to connect your destination wallet so click connect destination wallet and select your preferred wallet for this example i'll be using rabi so now that your solana devnet and evm wallet are connected the next thing to do is to select soul as the token to bridge from solana devnet to mona testnet so click the drop down menu to select the token and here you see the option to select your soul so click so and click the drop down menu at the bottom to select the destination token make sure you select w so the next thing to do is to enter the amount of so you want to bridge to mona testnet wait for the quotes to come up so here you can see this transaction will take about 13 seconds to complete so click confirm transaction if you see this prompt click i trust the site and approve the transaction in your software wallet after about 13 seconds, you should be ready to claim the token on Monad. So click this button and accept the signature request in your wallet. So now the transaction is complete. So now that we've bridged so from Solana DevNet to Monad Testnet, it's time to swap it to Mon. So head over to Ambient Finance. You will find the link in the description. If you use the link from the description, it will take you directly to the Soul Mom pair. But if you're visiting Ambient Finance directly from the DAP, make sure you are on the trade menu and you can select so from the drop down menu. So if you don't see so, make sure you import it via the contract address. To do that, copy the contract address from the description and paste it in the search bar here and you see so here. So click on it and it will add to the DAP. So here, enter the amount of so you want to swap. So here I can see that the price impact is about 53%. This means I'll be getting 53% less than what I should be getting. So if you are seeing a high price impact, you can wait for the price impact to reduce or you go ahead with the swap if you don't care. If you want to go ahead with the swap for cases where there is a high price impact, click this button here that says I understand the price impact of the swap submit anyway. So click the button and accept the signature request in your wallet so now the transaction is completed and we've swapped some so for mon on mona tested so that's how you get mon by bridging so from solana devnet to mona testnet don't forget you can also get mon by bridging sepolia x so check out the video in the description for how to do that
You will also find a link to server faucet on Monarch Testnet in the description. So check it out and claim as much money as you can. If this video has helped you, like, comment, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you have any issues, ask for help in the comments or in my Telegram group. You will find the link to the group in the description. Join my Telegram channel for more Monarch Testnet updates, crypto adverbs, tips, and tutorials. Check out the bonus section of this video description for some of the hottest testnets you can join. So keep pushing transactions on the Monarch Testnet. Stay safe and I'll see you in the next video.